This video is about the retiring of Microsoft Delft. But first I want you to ask uh, to like and subscribe to my channel and share this video with uh, everyone you know. Uh, yes, uh, suddenly on the 14th of December in my message center there was a message that they are going to retire Microsoft Delft. First you have to know of course what Delft is, but let's uh, first go into the message. In the message it states Delft Web is going away uh, the second half of 2024 to be uh, uh, correct they even uh, mentioned a date here the 16th of uh, December it should be uh, retired uh, in 2024 and um, they are going to focus on profile cards in Microsoft 365 which is a very uh, I think a very good thing um, and uh, what will change well they uh, will change the Delft web which we are going to show in a minute um, and they are are going to do something in between uh, or at least they are going to create new things uh, for the profile cards um, to be uh, honest Till now I know they only store the data in the user profile of SharePoint so I'm curious what's going to be uh, done with that in the end. Uh, for now nothing changes there so the content will still be accessible uh, there. But let's go first to Delve because Delve is this application. Maybe you have seen it, maybe not. Uh, in Delve you will find uh, the uh, profile information of somebody. Let's go to Alex, he's got a better profile. Um, telephone number, uh, where he is or where she is in the organization. Um, what documents are shared between you. Um, and this is always a very uh, interesting thing because um, somehow people think if they share it with the whole organization nobody can see it but that's a false uh, positive and this was a great reason why lots of companies uh, shut down delve in the first place but of course this is uh, not the way to do it because if i go to debbie you see that we have quite a lot of documents uh, that we share together and this could be on sharepoint but it could also be on onedrive you don't know that but um, the main thing is it's shared and this was something that uh, most companies or a lot of companies were scared of they uh, turned off the delve uh, so nobody could see it anymore but still it was shared with them so that was already a thing and now with the new things you i can already see that there's a possibility to do it as well with the profile cards so um, this is going away this side uh, with all this information but to be honest i think most information is already in the profile card so let's go to the profile card so for this i go to office.com i'm uh, already logged in and here i can search for example for alex and i can click on him and you directly see information about him. So here we see that uh, email address, chat, phone number, which department, job title. Of course, this still needs to be filled in uh, within your organization. You see the messages, uh, the organization, who his manager is in this case. And we directly see the content. So in this case, nothing is shared with me or from Alex. I can also see the messages, I can see the contact information and the organization, where he's placed in the organization. Now, Alex is a nice example because he has a lot of information in there, but no file shares. So you remember maybe I showed you Debbie. And when we go to Debbie, we see that we have a lot of content shared and messages. So here I go to content and then you see that all things are shared you can even see 
where they are shared so this is a big difference because here you couldn't see where it's shared from and here you see it directly on the icon the messages the contact information so this is basically already delve it only doesn't have your skills in there and i think they are going to work hard on that uh, to get that in within uh, time uh, so that you can add your own skills your hobbies etc because that was uh, mostly about delve mm, another thing to be aware of the content that i see here uh, is similar to delve but it um, this is something you need to be aware of uh, because also when you are going to uh, implement for example copilot in the future uh, all those documents will come up so be aware of that um, then as last I want to show you teams because in teams you maybe you know maybe not but in this case I have Debbie when I hover over her um, you already see that there's a lot of information here and I click, can click on show more and I get the overview of her um, the contact the organization LinkedIn I don't see the files directly but uh, that's only a minor because still when we would search here I guess we search for Debbie it will it will not pop up but if I do it from the office bar here then it shows so I'm curious um, did you use Delve are you going to implement something else uh, how about adoption did you do the adoption uh, about Delve or did you shut it down and is this a new era for you that you think oh this is something we didn't think about so governance uh, let me know in the comments and uh, yeah that's it for this one uh, so if you want to view the best video for you then click here if you want to see the playlist click here and else in the middle you can subscribe to my channel thanks for watching see you next time